I feel really bad. My condolences go out to any family, anyone that got hurt. I feel real bad. Now at six, a mother speaking out after her son was involved in a deadly Walmart shooting. Jamari wasn't the one shooting. You know, Jamari just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Tonight, she says her son made a bad choice, but doesn't belong behind bars. It's the interview you'll see only on CBS News Miami. Now, he wasn't the only one arrested. The shooter, police say, has been caught. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench joins us now with what the mother of one of the suspects had to say. Ravita Brown told me she feels terrible about what happened at this Walmart store and is disappointed that her son was tied to this crime. He was one of three people arrested. Ravita Brown tells me she could not stop thinking about the deadly shooting at the Walmart store when she first heard about it. Basically, when I heard that what was going on yesterday, I was unfortunately just clocked in at work. And the first thing I, you know, I said, I say, I hope my son wasn't at Walmart. But sadly, she says, her son was not only there, but he was also tied to the crime. You never thought something like this might happen? No, I didn't. No, I did not at all. I did not know that at all. Miami-Dade police say three people, including Ravita Brown's son, Jamari Hodge, approached the victim, 23-year-old Nathaniel Baez. They fought, and police say 25-year-old Steve Leston pulled out a gun and shot and killed Baez. 20-year-old Roberto Acevedo and Hodge were charged with battery. Cell phone video captured the chaos. Everybody started running. I heard people yelling to everyone to get out of the store. Next thing I know, people were pushing me, and I ended up out of the store. I mean, I thought I was going to die. One man was shot in the foot, and one woman suffered a head injury when she ran away. I feel really bad. My condolences go out to any family, anyone that got hurt. I feel real bad. Hodge's mother says she is also disappointed that her son was involved in this incident. Everyone made choices on their own every day, so... That just the choices that he he didn't make the right choices. Jamari wasn't the one shooting. Mm -hmm. You know, Jamari just in the wrong place at the wrong time. It's that just that situation. Are you gonna say anything to him when he comes home? Of course, I'm gonna have a talk to him. What are you gonna tell him? Jamari, we talked about this in the, the past and the future, so. As a parent, Ravita Brown told me she has always tried to steer her son towards the right path in life. Meanwhile, Miami-Dade police say they are not looking for anyone else. They say all suspects have been arrested. In Florida City, Peter Dench, CBS News, Miami.